How to do something in China? I am Day. Are you the type of person who enjoys chatting while drinking or prefer to play games? I am the latter group. When I'm drinking with unfamiliar friends, I think games can be a great icebreaker. So, what's the most popular games in China and how to play it? It's definitely Yao Shaizi, also known as Bluffy. So, today let's talk about how to bluff your friend. Five, five. Five, six. Six, six. I don't believe it. Over. Before we begin, it's important to know the core of this game is to guess the total number of a specific dice. For example, when two people are playing with 10 dice, you need to guess how many of them are 6 or how many are 5s. You don't have to guess all the numbers, only one will do. Understand this is the key to play this game. Now let's dive into details. First, each person needs a dice cup and 5 dice. Shake your dice cup and check your numbers. Take turns to call on numbers. The first number you say represents the number of the dice, and the second one represents the number on the dice. For example, if my dice shows two twos, two fives, and one six, I might guess that the other person has at least one five. So, the total number of fives will be three, and I can call out three fives. The second person who calls needs to either increase the number of the dice, or increase the number on the dice. If I call three fives, the next person could call three six or four fives, as long as one of the numbers is bigger than mine. Here is a gesture tip. Place your hand over his desk cup and give a thumb up, indicating that you are raising the number. It will go up and up until someone doesn't believe the last person and says, I don't believe you. Everyone needs to open their desk cups. For example, if I say five six, if there are indeed five or more six on the table, he loses and has to drink. If there are not, then I lose. Attention please! The number 1 can represent any number in this game. Sounds complicated? Let's see a demo. Come on! 4-6. Five, 5-5. Five. Five, six. Six, six. I don't believe you. Go to hell! No! One thing to note is that you need to understand can gestures because most parts are quite noisy and you don't have to shout. You can play with your friend with gestures. So the first gesture means the number of the dice and the second gesture means the number on the dice. Basically, it's a mind game because you don't really know what dice are on the table. However, it's also a performance game because you can pretend you have it. Remember, you need to bluff with confidence to let others believe you. Seven, six. Last one. More! More! Open! Oh no. <laughs> Congratulations! Now you know how to play the most popular games in China. Making content is not easy. Please like and subscribe. See you next time!